Are you getting ready to sell your home and want to hear about the do's and the don'ts to staging your home? Well, do stay tuned. Welcome to Step Into The Valley. I'm Katrina with the Three Step Realty Group in the Livermore and Tracy areas. Selling your home can be a stressful process, but with the right mindset and approach, it can also be exciting and rewarding. One of the most important aspects of selling your home is staging it to attract potential buyers. Staging your home involves creating an atmosphere that appeals to a wide range of people, making them feel welcome and inspired to make that offer. Here are some do's and don'ts to keep in mind when staging your home for sale. Do declutter and clean. No one wants to buy a home that's cluttered and dirty. Before you start staging, take time to declutter and clean your home thoroughly. Get rid of any unnecessary items and put away personal belongings like photos and knickknacks. Make sure your home is spotless. Pay attention to the floors, baseboards, the bathrooms, and the kitchen. Don't over-personalize. While it's important to create a warm and inviting atmosphere, be careful not to over-personalize your space. Potential buyers want to be able to picture themselves living in your home. So remove any items that may make them feel like they're intruding on someone else's personal space. Do use neutral colors. When it comes to colors, less is more. Use neutral colors like white, beige, or gray to create a clean and fresh look. This allows potential buyers to envision their own style in the space and avoids distracting with bold colors. Don't ignore curb appeal. First impressions are everything, so make sure your home's exterior looks as inviting as the interior. Clean up any debris and clutter in the yard, trim the hedges and bushes, add some fresh flowers, and maybe some potted plants to the entrance to make it feel welcoming. Do let in natural light. Natural light is a crucial factor in creating a warm and inviting space. Open up the curtains, open up those blinds to let in as much light as possible. And if your home doesn't get much natural light, invest in some floor or table lamps to create a bright and welcoming atmosphere. Don't neglect the details. Small details can make a big difference in how your home is perceived. Make sure all the light bulbs are working. Replace any outdated or damaged fixtures and add some fresh flowers or greenery to liven up the space. These small touches can make a big impact on potential buyers. Remember, staging your home for sale is all about creating an atmosphere that appeals to a wide range of people. By following these do's and don'ts, you'll be well on your way to creating a space that potential buyers will love. So take a deep breath, put on some music, and enjoy the process of creating a warm and inviting space that will make someone else feel right at home. Thanks so much for watching. If you're thinking about buying or selling a home, give us a call. We would be honored to be there for you. And if you liked this video, let us know by giving us a thumbs up. Of course, if you have any questions, drop it in the comments below and we'll get back to you. And lastly, if you want to see more videos like this, be sure to hit that subscribe button for more real estate advice and news. Talk to you soon.